Well, one of the highlights of my professional career has been uh, opening the Clovis North area and the Clovis North Educational Center. And from the very beginning, uh, all of us that were working on it, the, the vision for it was to be a articulated 712 campus that, that we'd have systems in place that would allow kids to um, to be able to transition smoothly from sixth grade all the way through 12th grade. What I enjoyed most about opening up Clovis North was again the hiring of staff to get to know individuals from many different schools, many different areas, and to create something new and being part of uh, that new new culture, the new um, expectations. And it was just neat to have groups of individuals that you knew wanted to be there, wanted to be part of something new, and wanted to be some of the foundational leaders uh, for the area. I remember sitting over in the professional development building in our first sort of faculty staff meeting because we really didn't have any buildings over at Clovis North to meet in. And we were in the boardroom, and it was just Carlo and I kind of talking about what we thought the vision would be. And that was after we'd gone through the transfer process and through interviews, and there may have been 35 of us, you know, really preparing for 7th, 8th, and ninth graders. It wasn't that many. We saw some hiring to do, but we wanted to make sure everybody knew what they were getting themselves into and um, how big a deal we really felt like this was and how much work it was going to be. They were just really excited about this whole idea of starting a complex. 712. And so for kids to be in one place for six years, have the same counselor, have that same identity as a Bronco was really exciting. Some of you didn't have a choice of whether or not you're in the Close North area, and some of you did. But ultimately, I think we all made the best of it. And I think our students are the ones who are benefiting from it right now. I remember the first day of high school was very strange. It was very strange going from Alta Sierra of 1,800 people to Clovis North of, I think at the time, like 250, 300 on a good day. And walking around and just being like, is this what high school is supposed to be like? And one thing that really stuck out when I came here is how close-knit everyone seemed. They all kind of became a family because they all had to share this new experience of being the first graduating class of a new school or the second in my case. And I felt welcome as soon as I stepped onto the campus. When I kind of think about where to give credit for my time here. Um, it definitely is with the people, just because everyone here was new and, and that you know, made, it, made it fun and it was memorable because we were all kind of taking things one step at a time, um, both students and staff, and that was really cool. And I think a lot of the teachers here at Clovis North have helped shape the person I've become and who I aspire to be. And I learned that you know, the passion and love for teaching is something that you have to actually care about and you want to help kids grow and you want to help them succeed in that. The things that I probably enjoyed most about attending Clovis North was joining the clubs and all the extracurricular activities because there's a lot available. And now that I'm back coaching here, it's, uh, it's cool to be able to see everything that sort of we started and how everybody else behind us has made it grow. Going back to the football games and other events at Clovis North and seeing the students doing things that we did um, what, eight years, eight, nine years ago. Um, so I think it's cool that the students now and the staff have kept traditions that we built the first four years of the school being open. When you're given a blank canvas, uh, as we were here, you can kind of create with it what you want. So, you know, I think we set a great foundation and a great, um, you know, a precedent for the rest of these classes to con continue through here. So I, I was, I'm glad that I was a part of that. I feel, um, I feel that we are part of something special. We'll always look back and say that we kind of started things over there. The work that the whole area has put into the growth of Clovis North Educational Center has really paid off. I think the, uh, the academic excellence, the co-curricular excellence, the, uh, the amazing performing arts teams that we have, that we have going at, uh, at, at Clovis North Educational Center. It's all because of all the hard work that the area has put in.
Congratulations, Broncos. What a remarkable 10 years this has been. You've built an absolutely incredible educational program and system and center for our students. The Clovis North area really is one that's special that people want to come to, and it's all because of you. All of your hard work, your care, your dedication, compassion, it's all about the people. You have made the Clovis North area, Clovis North Ed Center, really something special. I'm so very proud of you. Congratulations, Broncos. 10 years and the sky's the limit for you. Go Broncos. So when Carlos called and said, hey, we're trying to do a video on the 10 year anniversary of our Clovis North Educational Center, the Clovis North area, I said, no way. There's no way. It's been 10 years, but then I uh, checked the mirror, and I have a lot grayer hair and a lot less of it. But I went into the archives and I pulled out the PowerPoint that we used that first day of school in the Clovis North, uh, it wasn't the NPR, it was the library lecture hall, and we had the entire area in there because we were trying to develop an area concept that's articulated K-12, that had the same values and the same culture and the same focus on excellence and on kids. And so I, I got that PowerPoint right here. And I'm going to read you some of it. And I'm going to put on my glasses because, you know, that's another thing that's not as good as it was 10 years ago. I think we're playing the Rudy th theme, too, at the same time. So it's an opportunity of a lifetime, an opportunity to build new traditions, to make a difference, to create, to dream, an opportunity to blaze new trails and reach new heights, an opportunity to discover, to excel, to learn, an opportunity to compete, to soar, an opportunity to raise the banners. Clovis North will be a community that works together and believes in each other, a community where students believe in their teachers and teachers believe in their students, where character counts and everyone contributes. This is Clovis North. Do you believe? And our final, final slide, and I think you still use this today, is join the stampede. So have a great school year, Clovis North. Clovis North area, I'm proud of you. I'm proud to have been a part of it. Saw her face. Now I'm a believer. 